Yo, what's cracking everyone? Eric Ship Triple One here. So the next update for Forza Horizon 5 Series 21 begins next Thursday on the 25th of May. It will be titled as Explore the Horizons. And what we know thus far is that there will be new cars, overlanding modifications, Pathfinder accolades, and of course, a brand new photo mode. Now, just before we begin, I know I don't normally do this at the start of my videos, but if you are new to my channel, please do smash the thumbs up button in the end if you did enjoy today's video. And if you would like to stay up to date with everything Forza Horizon 5 related, be sure to subscribe with notifications turned on so that you won't miss out on any Horizon 5 content that goes live. All right. So with that said, Forza Horizon's official Twitter has just tweeted their latest Torben Tuesday. And just a quick reminder for those that don't know what a Torben Tuesday is, basically a week prior to a new Horizon 5 series update, Playground Games will tweet a Torben Tuesday, which are basically some clues or teasers as to what we can expect for the upcoming series. So what did Forza Horizon 5 post for Update 21's Torben Tuesday? Well, here is the tweet. It is titled as they are the same photo, which obviously isn't. I mean, we have one photo where there is a Vauxhall Monaro VXR, which is of course already featured in Forza Horizon 5. And for those living in Australia will of course know that this is a Holden or more specifically an HSV GTO or an HSV GTS Coupe. And then we have the sun shining brightly with Torben standing in front doing a Forza Horizon 5 emote. And the other photo is just the car with Torben inside and clearly the developers have gone in and decreased the exposure of the photo to make it look much darker than the first image. So what is the takeaway from the tease? Well first, let's not look too deep into the vox hole that was used in this image. At first I was thinking, no way are Playground Games finally including some more Australian vehicles. As just recently, one of you, the subscribers, commented on my latest videos asking for just more Aussie cars. And no, sadly, that is just not the case. I even zoomed in on the badge to see if it was an HSV, but nope, it's a Vauxhall. Another speculation I had was maybe perhaps Playground Games was using the Vauxhall as a test for the first time in a Forza game that a car model was being replaced as for those who may not be aware, this Monaro has been featured in the Forza franchise since Motorsport 2 and is one of the older car models with textures being upgraded. But I don't think that's going to happen either. However, what the tweet does tease is of course the new updated photo mode for Series 21. Let's hypothetically say that these two were the same image and if we were to transition this into the world of Horizon 5, then what I'm assuming is that one, we can get our driver tars outside of the car and do perhaps either the emote that you have currently equipped your driver tar with or choose any emotes you desire. Two, if you take a look at the cars between the two photos, the first image has the wheels turned at a certain degree while the other is straight suggesting that within the new upgraded photo mode, you can now adjust what angle you want your wheels to be turning without having to decide before going into photo mode, which I will say is about time playground games. This will make taking photos and coming up with thumbnails for my videos a little bit easier. And three, of course, one of the images has been darkened and this clue is basically hinting that we can now finally change the time of day when it comes to taking our photos. Now, of course, there are a couple of questions that I do have should let's say this was just a tease for the upcoming photo mode. I wonder, could we also be able to change the seasons when we are specifically in photo mode? As I'm sure many of us know that the different seasons do change the environment. So will this option be available? And also along with the ability to change the time of day, Will we be able to manipulate the weather too? For example, if the photo was taken on a sunny day, will we be able to change that so that the weather ends up raining, thunderstorms, or even a sandstorm? 
basically options that are rather similar to when we are making our own custom event. And in my opinion, I think that would certainly improve the photo mode feature by a lot. I know games like The Crew 2 includes all of these features right now and has so for many years. Therefore, to me at least, it would be good to see a near fully customizable photo mode with all of these features. But sadly, that is all we pretty much got for this month's Torben Tuesday. We didn't get any clues on what overlanding modifications we might see, no new hints on some of the new cars in Series 21, and I know some of you might be asking, should we be worried then if the developers aren't showing any of those specific teasers? Honestly, I would be lying if I said no completely. There's been so many times in the past whenever there was a Torben Tuesday and there were some awesome cars that were going to be featured in an upcoming update, Playground Games will usually tease it to the point that it's quite obvious. But this time round, we didn't really see anything, considering that the theme of Series 21 is going out to explore and this specific tease didn't really suggest any of that at all. As of right now, I have no clue what cars Playground Games are going to introduce for Series 21. Are they going to fit with the Explore the Horizon theme? Or are they just going to be a randomly selected group of new to Forza cars? And on top of that, the overlanding modifications. Now, I did mention what these were in my previous videos. They are essentially off-roading modifications that are applied to vehicles if you are about to go do some serious off-roading or even camping as well. And some of these upgrades may include increasing tire size, which of course we did see in update 19, specifically for SUVs and pickup trucks. But could this suggest that we may see this customization finally available for all vehicles in Horizon 5, kind of like the Nissan Fairlady Z Forza Edition, or maybe Playground Games could be adding more to the SUV with a group of generic modifications, similar again to Update 19's rally mods to certain cars. Also, overlanding mods includes a snorkel, an aggressive tow hook, which if we take a look at the teaser image once again, the Vauxhall does coincidentally have a very unique looking tow hook that's different to the generic ones we have seen in Horizon 5 and far more aggressive looking as well. Could that also be a subtle tease? And also, of course, there are suspension upgrades. Man, I wish I could tell you guys so much more with this Series 21 tease, but Overall, I'm curious to see what holds once they reveal everything, which I believe will happen either late this week or early next week. Fingers crossed, Playground Games can make it three updates in a row with excellent content. I will keep you guys all up to date if there are any new information that comes out in regards to Explore the Horizons. Anyways, what are your opinions on this month's Torben Tuesday? Share them down in the comment section below and also what we may get for Series 21. I do read all of your comments, guys. But anyways, if you guys did enjoy today's video, please make sure to smash the thumbs up button as it really does help me out. And of course, subscribe for more Forza Horizon 5 update and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.